Today we're building we're building each other in The Sims. And then at the end they're gonna react to what the other has done. Yeah, that sounds good. You excited? What we have done is probably the best way, the best way to say what's about to happen. How do I make this head as big as possible? Is that the biggest I can make the I, head? I think it is. I want well, this to be as realistic as possible. <laughs> and for it to be realistic, his head has to be disproportionately large. I'm downloading his face in my head right now. Oh, God. I can't remember what his nose looks like. No, that's definitely not it. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's good too. Ooh, that's even better. This is like I'm at the optometrist. Oh boy, what in the world have I created here? He looks like someone from The Incredibles now. All right, that's good. I could live with that. I make him as skinny and lanky as possible. <laughs> Whoa. Capisani, huh? <laughs> <laughs> then you can change his wardrobe. Oh, man. Okay. Okay, now we're really cooking with grease. We do have the same boots. Look at these bad boys. We kill ghouls in these boots. I'm pretty proud of myself right now. I thought this was a disaster at first. It's gone to a place where I think that's a digital shame, despite the head being a little more normal than usual. Eh, good enough. Sporty, he doesn't play sports, so we'll skip that. What is this? Sleep. You guys have had sleepovers, right? Yeah, let's see what, just like a shirt and sweatpants. That's actually pretty accurate. I'll keep that. Yeah, that's, that, that, that's good. Swimwear, uh, that kind of deal. It's to cover up more of the legs, because if you wore those tiny things, he would look like Jack Skellington walking around the beach. It's not a good look. Over here is where you kind of like give him a personality. Master vampire, maybe. Let's give him a nerd brain. Let's go a creative, yep. cheerful. Kleptomania, maybe. I mean, he could have been hiding things from me for a while. I don't live with him despite popular belief. Evil. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I love it. See, it fit right in. He loved it, he accepted it. I think he's gonna be pretty pleased with this Shane, to be honest. I'd be a little hurt if he doesn't like the version of Shane I gave him. I'm gonna start. Check out these eyes. I wanna find ones that have big bags under them. He's seen a lot. We've seen a lot. Let's go to the brow zone. Ryan's brows, they don't have a, a strong shape to them. They look like, they, like somebody just accidentally coughed some eyebrows onto his forehead. That's not an insult. I need a frown. <laughs> a little sourpuss Vergara. Hmm. I still haven't found any ghosts. It's been five seasons. He has a large mouth, right? Width-wise, you've seen him. I mean, I've you know seen what. him, but uh, if you put him on a lineup, now that I'm under pressure, I'm like, I don't know. You, do, you wouldn't be able I to pick Ryan out of a lineup? Oh. <gasps> He's like, anime! I don't like what I'm doing. Maybe I make He's his like real it. small, like, oh, I'm oh. scared. <laughs> If you want to know Don't what it's like it. <laughs> to be in a haunted house with Ryan, just look at this. If you're like, Ryan, are you okay? This is what he looks at you like. I feel like we're giving him too much brow credit. <laughs> this is when he gets angry. That's Ryan Steven Bergara. I can't believe wow. we found you. He's not happy to be here. Close time, fashion. Oh, we get to pick outfits. Mazarps. Mazarps. I hear you, man. He speaks Simish? I know this grouse is Fred O'Shea and Wobitus now. I know a lot of, uh... oh, Waza. And uh, tag tag. Do they still say all those things? Yes. Oh, great. When The Sims came out, I was obsessed with it. He just wears jerseys and hoodies all the time. Yeah, that looks about right. As boring as it is. What kind of trousers would you like, Ryan? He's like turned into Tomb Raider there. <laughs> yeah, what is this little satchel he's got? <laughs> Keeps all his jelly beans in there. I hear you guys them. have the same boot. I mean, I had these boots first. I've been wearing them for about 10 years. <gasps> Ryan bought a pair too. He liked them so much. Can't blame him. I make them look good. Now you're boot buddies. We're boot bros. <laughs> He does like sneaks. He's a sneakerhead. He's a sneakerhead. That's sport shoes for sure. He's ready to get out there and play ball with his boys. Maybe Steven Lim's around. I know the two of them are big ballers together. New show. Big ballers. <laughs> <laughs> Stephen Lim and Ryan Vergara. Next is his fancy wear. Oh, look at his little scarf. That's insufferable. I love it. Someone's got some ankles for us. Sport wear. What about that though? Ready for death. He's not ready for death though is the thing. <laughs> I'm ready for death in these houses. That's what makes me me. I'm ready every room we walk into to die. Ryan's afraid of that because he doesn't know what comes after it. I don't either. <laughs> <laughs> like, you do? No. You want to share with the class? <laughs> well, what? Hang on a sec. I need to see what this looks like. Yup. <laughs> That's what the aliens in this game wear. Well, it's also gonna be what Ryan Bergara wears. <laughs> Sleep. Sleepwear. What is he sleeping? You guys have had sleepovers. I think I found it. <laughs> but it'll be nighttime. <laughs> <laughs> what a weirdo. Party time. Obviously we have this as a backup. Uh-oh. Have you seen my little hot dog stories? I think I've seen like one yes. or two. Yes. There's a hot dog and he has a wife? Correct. And a car? Oh, you're on season one. I'm on season There's... There's 
Multiple Ooh. seasons oh. of the hot dog story? You would, you would be surprised how deep the lore is at this point. There's lore? Oh, yeah. Right now they're on an alien planet populated by sexy blue peaches called Plupples. And a holographic corn named Maisie is about to fight a giant Plupple to the death so that they can procure a ship that will travel back in time to save all their friends from being thrown into a volcano by a hot dog witch. Swimwear! He is from Southern California, so he might be like, I love palm trees. Pick an aspiration. I don't want to put knowledge because he doesn't respect science. <laughs> Master Vampire. That sounds close. Public Enemy. Famous Criminal. Maybe that's why he's so interested in crime. He does. He is obsessed with crime. He's like really obsessed with it. I feel good about that. There's no Ghost Hunter track on this. Not yet anyway. EA, we'll work with you. Making an expansion pack. I don't care. Whatever. Traits. <laughs> We're putting bro. <laughs> Erratic. Or nay, well, please. Yeah. Ooh. We could make him evil. He has threatened to kill me. A lot. I think eventually he will start murdering people when he runs out of ideas for true crime. <laughs> he gets riled up. All right, we're gonna bring Bugara back in here and let you guys see what you've done. Before we do this, how would you rate yourself in making me? Honestly, 10 out of 10. Yeah, I was about to give myself a nine. The only thing I'm realizing now is that you're a little more chipmunkish. They didn't allow me to make the parameters of your head larger than what would be considered proportionate. And I, as well, could not make you one foot below the average male height. Yes, yeah, so we both had our issues. Okay, okay. Woo! So there you go. I look like Ron Perlman. What <laughs> happened here? I'm gonna give you a four off the bat. Wait, wait, but I'd wait like, a second. I can't, can I make sure. a note? You, you can make a note on yourself. I think my eyes are maybe bigger. They're but little, let's, they're, you know. They're a little small. I'm not, here, I'm not here to critique. I, also, mouth way too big here. Okay, to be fair, you have a bizarre face. That's what I was saying. And that actually could be seen as good. Like, Benedict Cumberbatch is a weird looking fella. Yeah. And many women find him attractive. I find him attractive myself. Yeah, he's an attractive man. I think the clothing's pretty, pretty you good. You got this spot on. I would I never was, wear an unbuttoned flannel like that. But you I understand you the sentiment. Worn, you have worn that. Unbuttoned with a shirt underneath? Are you really that unsatisfied with your face? I think the people might be unsatisfied. I'm happy to All make I'm some changes as well. You can, you can maybe not be a coward and just say what you feel instead of making the audience be your proxy. I just wanna... Do you want me to make the modifications? Yes, I trust you. Use me as a paintbrush and Let's this is your canvas. go into the face zone. Oh, maybe different mouth. Yeah, oh, there's oh, so many yeah, mouths. There's... Did you not look at all the mouths? I didn't realize. Sorry, I know this is not how these videos go. Yeah, we're, <laughs> we're taking it off the rails here. Let me give you a little smirk. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Let me bring my mouth down. That may be part of the issue. You bring the nose down as well. Then you can bring the eyes down. Shift the whole face, really. Shift the whole face. I'm trying to, and it's not <laughs> letting me. Have okay. we made it worse? Yeah, I think we made it worse. See, this is what happens. What have you done? This looks nothing like you. <laughs> you look like Tobey Maguire. What the <laughs> f is going on? Is that better? I don't think so. I think you beefed it, Ryan. I beefed it? I'm acting at the behest of you here. I think the eyebrows. Yeah, I don't think it's that. Try these. That's Scorsese-ish. Try those. No, 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 definitely not that. Ooh, those. You're just pointing now. Uh, so. How about those? That's, That's it. what you had before. That's it. Adjust the eyebrow ridge. Tell us more about this ridge. Oh, you know what? You, we're, I think he's killing it right now. <laughs> oh, I didn't know that was an option. That's an op That's a good option because your face is narrow. Is it narrow or is it? You do kind of look like the head. Vincent Van Gogh scream painting when it comes to narrow heads. It's Van Gogh. That's Minch. Is that Minch? It's Minch. Minch? What's his first name? I have Slavic eyes. Is there a sadness slider? Oh, oh wow. Oh, yeah. You are very good. Well, now they've got my trademark sad eye. There was I a slider that, for sadness. I turned it up I think to that's a cherry on top there. Why don't you show him his outfit? Yeah. Let's oh, yeah. Him. That's yeah, what let's we were here that. for. I forgot yeah. about that. Great work, Ooh. Ryan. And yeah. Kelsey. I really just phoned it in when it came to the outfit. You just kind of... I was focusing on making the face, which I was pretty proud of. Is that a button fly? Never in a million years, buddy. All right. Wait, yes. go to my sporty. I think I skipped this tab. You just skipped it? I've never seen you in sporty attire. That's true. The one true. time I did, you were wearing a cheerleader outfit. That's a true story. That's a true story. Roll the tape. Yeah. There you go. This is you sleeping. Yeah. This is my party outfit. Is that supposed to be like my denim jacket? Yeah. Jacket. Swimwear. Hey, party time. Hell yeah. Nerd brain. Nerd brain. Cheerful. Cheerful. Creative. Creative. And evil. And evil. <laughs> <laughs> what a fun What a You'll fun set combo. people on fire, but you're going to have a great time doing it. All right. I'm into that. It seems like you really didn't put a lot of effort into the clothing, so I'm going to give you a six out of 10. You can't fault me for the sports thing because that's accurate. That's just me knowing you. That aside, you said I phoned these in. That's true. I did say that. Here's Ryan. That looks... <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
my god. That's you. You gave me the beadiest eyes I've ever seen in my life. That's what your eyes look like they, when you get scared. My pupils aren't capable of getting that small. Yeah, they are. This makes me look like I'm in a perpetual state of fright and yes, hypnotizing that's people. That's right. I think we gotta go and make some, some adjustments here. This is ridiculous. All right, fine. I think this is dead on. Right there. Okay, well, you just shrunk them back huh? down to no, where they were. <laughs> what do you mean? Okay, I'll make them bigger. Right there. Stop! <laughs> make those pupils normal size, you son of a That's pretty good. No. Make the pupils at least touch the tops. There we go. I'll settle for that. I'll settle for that. Okay. I'll settle. You just keep That's shrinking fine. them down no, after they, I like, say they're touching settle. the bottom. That's not how a they're deal works. They're touching the bottom. There we go. No, wait, no, stop. <laughs> yeah, you said there we go. Great. Fine, you know what, whatever. It's fine. That looks like you. And also the hair is just a little too neat. Also, I have a very stern demeanor on. I think I have a bigger lips too. That's too much. <laughs> Why don't you give the mouse to Kelsey? Cause she, she- Kelsey, you're so good at this. You could do this for the police, Kelsey. You can just bring like a basic face in and the people would describe what the man looked like yeah, and you'd, you'd be just be working your little magic. I, I think that's pretty good. I think they're both okay approximations of each other. All right, let's take a tour of the outfit. So there's your casual attire. Also Why? sort of looks like yeah, a ghost like, gear. Oh, you gave me a little- A little satchel for your jelly beans. I, I don't, I don't- you don't have jelly. I mean, it's for your ghost gear. Oh yeah, for something. like holy water pistols. Or like your- Or jelly beans if I'm in the mood. Moving on. What in the name of God have you done? That's you going out to a party. Is it? Yeah. You have like that one uh, hoodie that's like a giant collar. Yeah, yeah, but it's attached to a sweatshirt though. Yeah, and maybe you're wearing that underneath. Moving on to athletic wear. Now, this was a bold choice. Oh, okay. What? Ready to hit the b-ball court with your your main baller, Steven Lim? Ready to fight the, with the rest of the Justice League? What yeah. the f did you do? How is that even an option in the Sims generator? You gotta dig deep. <laughs> this is what you get for phoning it in. Moving on Horrible. to nighttime now. Ooh, sleepy time. I'm a little worried now because these tabs are escalating in weirdness. Uh, come on, nighttime. You, I f knew it. <laughs> It's a darker shade. Yeah, I can see that. An evening look. I'm sorry I took my exercise seriously. Now we're moving on to party. Unbelievable. Party mode. Unbelievable. Are you ready to get ready for your no, big I'm, party? No, frankly, I'm not ready. This is probably going to be a pink version of that now. What would you wear to a party, Ryan? Not that. I'll no, tell no, you. no, not this. It's... Yeah, yeah. Don't think I could have imagined that, but kudos to you <laughs> for fine. You like your little hat? Honestly, I was a little distracted by the hot dog, you know. <laughs> I figured since you're such a big fan of the hot dog guy, mm -hmm. and swimwear, last but not least. Frankly, I'm a little sad that you phoned this one in. Not a lot of options, right? Personality. Public enemy. Yeah, wants to make enemies and be a famous criminal. Cool. Uh, you're obsessed with crime. So, <laughs> bro. Bro. I mean, I like the shaka. Yeah. You also have hot-headed. These sims tend to be angry, can rile up other sims, and become angry when targeted with mischief. Last part, I guess we, we just saw that. And last <laughs> but not least, erratic. These sims can talk to themselves and have unpredictable emotions. That's the first one I have agreed with yeah. this entire time. Because you'll sit at your desk and be like, <laughs> I do talk to myself quite a bit. It's odd. I was going for the realism here. Hindsight right. is twenty twenty. So we built our boys. We're going to upload them to the gallery. And then we want you to build a nice little haunted house yeah, for us to a, live in. a little spooky village. You make it yeah. disgusting build and full of ghosts. So we could set it on fire. Put a graveyard in it. Because I'm a crime man. Put a bunch a, of a, dead a bodies and ghosts in it. Or throw a great party so I could show up in my stupid hot dog suit. Can't wait to see all your haunted houses that they'll get to check out next time. Unbelievable. Can we make each other fight to the death? Probably. In my hot dog suit. <laughs>